All right, I understand we're here because of a few blackheads. So, what's it gonna take to get that video down? My client's complexion is her livelihood, Mr. Specter. Not only did this incident harm her brand, it brought her emotional anguish. It was so bad, I couldn't post a video for a week. Except the one defaming my client. Well, I had to show people what it did to my face. It was shaming. Which is why, in addition to the video staying up, we've prepared this. Listen to me. If every 16-year-old girl files suit every time she wasn't happy with what she saw in the mirror, our legal system would grind to a halt. I'm not every 16-year-old girl, Mr. Spector. And you want me to take down that video and not file this? I want $10 million. I see. So this is a shakedown. This is a legitimate claim. And your wisest course of action would be to write that check. My course of action is gonna be to hit you with a defamation suit because you have no proof our product caused your breakouts. And I don't think you understand that I have 50 million followers who will do anything I tell them to. So even if that video comes down, I can tell them not to use your client anyway. That's it. I don't care how old you are. You know what you're doing. You deserve what's coming for you. And this meeting's over. Okay, Harvey. Okay what? Okay. Why don't you make your jokes about me and Sheila procreating so we can get to you filling me in on Joan's emergency? I don't need to fill you in, Lewis. I got it from here. No, you don't have anything. You were just supposed to babysitter. That's the thing about actually being at work, Lewis. Situations change, and you make adjustments. This isn't a situation. This is you taking my client. And you were the one okay with clients leaving if that's what they wanted. So that's what this is about. You're mad because I let Dominic do what was best for him. No. This is about you left the office to get your girlfriend knocked up. I started working a case, and I'm going to finish it. Don't you bring Sheila into this. I didn't, Lewis. You did. Now, you listen to me closely, because I'm not going to say this again. Your services are no longer needed on this case. Now that we've made our introductions, I'd like to start with Harvey describing what he thinks Lewis's perspective is on the situation. I don't feel comfortable. Please, just say the first thoughts that come to mind. About how Lewis thinks? Huh. Let's see. Cat's ballet, Harvey Specter. Something like that. That is not what I sound like. All right, Lewis. You want to know what you sound like to me? I've been jealous of you since day one. You were always Jessica's favorite and everyone else's. You got everything I wanted without ever trying. In fact, I'm trying to have a baby because I, I, I think it will take my mind off of you, even though I know. Deep inside, it won't. Tell him to stop. He's being honest about his feelings, Lewis. What about your feelings about whose fault this whole thing was? What? Lewis. I should have known you just wanted to get me in here to have him tell me this is my fault. It is your fault. Lewis, we are not here to discuss fault. Well, then why the hell are we here? Because he took my client, he won't give her back, and he needs to apologize about what he just said about me having a baby. I am not apologizing about anything. You wanted me to come here, you said this was a safe place, and now you can't handle what I think about you trying to have a baby. No, 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 you don't get to make this my fault because it's always my fault. But I thought this time we could come here so you could tell him that it's his fault. But if all you're going to do is mock me and all you're going to do is coddle him, well, then you can keep Joan Walsh, you can go to hell, and this whole session is over. Well, this was a waste of time. Maybe so. But for what it's worth, I think you have some things you could work on. And provided Lewis was OK, I'd be happy to talk with you anytime. What the hell did you do that for? Because you and me are going out tonight. I'm going to say a lot of nice things to you, and there isn't going to be any record of it. I can live with that. Wait a minute. How long did it take for you to come to that with Stan? About 25 minutes. Why? I don't believe it. You're even better at therapy than I am. Maybe I am, but trust me. Stan likes you better than me, and he always will. You really think so? No, Lewis, I don't. Wait a minute. Does this mean I get to have Joan back? You sure can. And your first order of business is going to be telling her we filed suit against a 16-year-old that's going to make her look like sh What? You really did that? What can I tell you, Lewis? The fear of losing you makes a man do crazy things. Well, in that case, after showing I are pregnant, do you want to go mudding? No, Lewis, I don't. Well, how... 